Good morning, runners. This is Will from We Run Las Vegas. Going to give you a driving tour of the neighborhood. A lot of Florida, I call them Florida palm trees, but palm trees. Some neighbors have some Halloween decorations up. I'm going to take you by an interesting construction in the neighborhood. Let you see some stuff that's coming, going to be developed soon in, in the neighborhood. I try not to show addresses too much, but I don't want everybody just walking up to every house in the neighborhood. So. to some of the new construction around here. Okay, here we come. It's a nice sunny day down here in South Florida. I'm gonna try to stay on road a little bit okay now this right here this is like one of the largest single family constructions that's being placed here in this area I'm gonna go all the way around I think that's the pool house to the main house back there that you can see and that's the pool house the main house starts from that back garage area back there all the way to where you're gonna see and you're gonna see how massive this is once I go around the block and all these are other structures that's a part of this main house like I said all this is one they got guest houses everything the way that they built it I, you would have thought it was a hotel like this structure right here from what my understanding is coming down it just temporarily has it up now for security and um, some of the workers to stay in. This one also, those two structures are going to be knocked down. Make this turn so you can see. I'm going to slow up in front of the main house. So you can see how massive it is. I'm gonna do the whole. These two structures up here are like security houses. Or... I don't know, but all this is one house. And these other two structures. This is the main house in the back right there. You can see it. Slow down a little bit. So you can see how massive. The property is. I'm gonna actually pull it right here. I'm gonna get out so you can see how massive this whole construction is right here. Very massive structure. <laughs> That's one, two, three, four, five door garage. Then they have another garage on the other side. Got the moat. Yeah, just wanted to see some of the construction and update some of you guys. Cause a lot of you guys asking me about my help. I'm getting better. Starting to get circulation back in my arms. Being able to move around, but so I'm gonna start enjoying the neighborhood a little bit and let people get a little bit closer to why I'm moved around here. <laughs> because of structures like this. I'm gonna try to back out. It's a little narrow road. I'm trying my best to back out without causing an accident. Mm. 
Okay. Somebody needs to go to the gas station immediately, namely me. I'm gonna go back around. I always tell people I live, there's a ton of horses around where I live and people always wonder. Excuse me. So I never come to this other side so people can see all the horse farms, but to my horse lovers, I'm gonna go show you something. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna show you something that one of the neighbors around here has. It's real neat. All of those are cows and horses back in there. Everybody's like, oh, you're in South Florida? You got cows? Yeah, <laughs> cow, horses. But if you're a horse lover, I'm gonna show you something. That you're gonna be thank I thank you horse lovers for life. Try to keep the phone out of the wind while I'm driving. So you don't get all that wind noise. Yes. Farmhouses, I guess that's what you were calling them. Ranch houses, farmhouses, I don't know. Don't quote me on the technical term for them. Okay. Trying to stay out of the way of them. You see a lot of trash on the side of the road. We have what's called boat pickup. And this is the time for the boat pickup. Okay, here we come. Now, if you're a horse lover, you're gonna love this. There's some horses right there, but that's not what I'm talking about. I'm trying to speed up a little bit because there's cars behind me. If I start going slow, they're gonna be blowing their horn. Okay, here you go. This house here, and it's just basically a stable has a bunch of miniature horses if you can see them right there and especially as we get around to this other side you know, maybe i'll pull over and let these guys go around let them go around so you can see these beautiful miniature horses right here they have them all blindfold if you're a horse lover this Guy right here breeds a ton of miniature horses. Let me get over some so I can let this guy in this truck fly by. You can see they have a ton of miniature horses that day. I guess they breed them. I don't know. I don't know how to raise horses, whatever you do with horses. Seen because over here they let they have horses to us well in their yard. Sometimes they're up here at the gate, they have a couple of miniature horses. I guess that's well, I don't see them right now, but yeah, these neighbors, <laughs> these horses is like amazing to me, and they're so nonchalant about the horses. Me, I'm like, huh. Yeah. You see some of these buildings that they're building. They're building them just so they can raise horses. Some people around here raise dog, different breeds of dogs. And they do it all out of these places right here. Some of these places are not even homes. They're just created just so they can raise the animals. Place where I showed you where the miniature horses are at. I don't even think anyone lives technically there, but the farm is. It's not their house. Their house is somewhere else, from what I understand. Around here, this is considered horse country in South Florida, right here. Yeah, see this little tiny house. 
with all that back there stables for these horses. And there's one right there, got a mess on, he's at the gate. And that's what I think is real interesting about this neighborhood. You got, see, that's all a barn, not even the house. Both of those are barns for horses. And one of the neighbors for his kids, I'm gonna show you again. He fixed up this whole house. He does this whole Halloween haunted house thing for his kids every year. I don't wanna show this at this, but this is his house. He fixes it up, he gets the rides brought in for them. I don't know if you can see real. And he has the house fixed up. A whole haunted house just for his kids with the rides, the carnival rides, and it goes on. So I think they'll do like a this weekend. They're back there preparing for the party, I guess, whatever you want to call party or whatever this weekend. But yeah, so I'm out today just driving the neighborhood because I can't go too far because of some things, some complications with the health. But when I feel it, I get in the car and I drive around a little bit. But I'm headed back to the house. Probably shouldn't be driving, but I take a chance every now and then. But y'all runners, y'all have a good day. This is Will from We Run Las Vegas. Hope to see y'all soon in Las Vegas.